If you want to require certain power policies be applied or denied or enabled or disabled, for everyone who uses your computer you can set group policies for those rules. To get started in a run dialog box type gpedit.msc, press OK. This opens the local group policy editor on the machine. To access the policies that are available, expand computer configuration, expand administrative templates, system, and then let's click power management. Notice we have folders of settings, folders for button settings, hard disk settings, notification settings, and so on. And notice from this larger group we have the option to specify a custom active power plan and select one. For the sake of exploration, let's double click sleep settings and look at all of these settings I can configure. I'm going to click standard. I've been playing around with this a little. You can see I've enabled one, but uh, for the most part, well, they all are not configured by default. Not configured doesn't mean they're not enabled. They may be enabled by default. So when you configure it, you may say, I want to disable that particular action. So let's just double click one of these. Require a password when the computer wakes, when it's on battery. This is not configured, but if you double click this, you'll see that if you enable the policy or do not configure it at all, the user will be prompted for a password when the system resumes from sleep. If you don't want that to happen though, and you click disabled, the user will not be prompted for a password when the system resumes from sleep. I'm going to cancel this. Notice all of the other options. Notice the options in all of the other containers here. You can really, really button down exactly what you want to happen using power policies at your personal computer no matter who is using it.